寄せ江戸天聖Make sure I go ahead and check out our Patreon for exclusive <laughs> access to full length reactions and some exclusive reactions that don't even hit YouTube. Make sure I go ahead and click that link. Appreciate y'all and back to your record schedule program. What's going on, y'all? It's reanimated. You got okay. me right. Listen, I love this series. Make Hell sure you... of a boss is fucking awesome. No, nah, it's definitely, it definitely is. Make sure you tell them happy Halloween, bro. Happy Halloween. -y. We have the Spookage and we have Vonnie Kruger. Yes, sir. And we are here with Hell of a Motherfucking Boss, the season finale? Part one. Part one. <laughs> so, part two, whenever that is. I don't know, but yeah. But it's like this is the perfect thing for Halloween. -y. It actually is. Why are you calling it Halloween? Because mm, I can. You can, but you sh that doesn't mean you should. I really hope they bring back that snake nigga. Oh, you're talking about um from episode like four? Something around there. The one that the was gold -tooth the one that was voiced by Norman Reedus. You don't watch Walking Dead. Never mind. Yeah. I don't. Anyway. <laughs> but you know who I'm talking about. The yeah. one at the um it was like it was at Millie's like parents' house. When he was getting fucked up by the when he was getting fucked up by the shark. And the shark like came out of the uh, the pool and like elbow dropped on him and shit. I don't think so. I think it was a different. Maybe, possibly. It yes. was. Yeah, because yeah. he was trying to like prove to Millie that he His was parents? Um, to her parents. I mean. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. I don't know. Are you ready to get it started? Episode seven. Do I have to do a recap about how they beat ass? Oh wait, no, that animation upgrade. Oh, no, the animation was that crazy. animation upgrade. Yeah. Was like, oh, I can't wait to see what they do for the finale, dog. We gonna see, man. We gonna see. Let's, let's see. You ready? Man, yeah. All right, man. All right, MXC. <laughs> Shouts out to Vizzy Pop, too, for always, you know, producing dope content. And add. God damn it. <laughs> oh, yes, this next ad is about to be three hours long. Interesting. Your discretion is advised. I'll make that my thing. Let's kill. Oh, God. The culture will understand. Welcome to M-City. Is that, is that Doofenshmirtz's fucking telescope? Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? Ton of lumberjacks. God damn, you strong too! You better stay jazzed, babe, because guess where I'm taking you tonight? Don't you dare finish a filthy pun in my presence, Moxie. Sides, drinks are on me tonight. Let's hit up the new dive down the street. Actually, sir, it's our one year marriage anniversary. Oh, so congrats. I'm taking Millie. To Ozzy's in the Lust Ring. <gasps> Ozzy's? Oh. No way! That place is always booked. Yeah, well, I've been planning it for quite a while. I'll pull some strings. Ozzy! Good job, Beast Boy. Uh, can you two not? <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. Maybe another time. Yo, he's gonna no, go fine. in. fine. I, I can come with the two of you. Help you celebrate your boring as fuck monogamy. Uh, <laughs> the reservation is for us. Uh huh. Just us. <laughs> mm hmm. Without you there. Explicitly without you there. I'll wear something nice. It's a big deal after all. <laughs> See you, love bugs, later. Relax, sweetie. Hey, Don't let him get to you today. Let's just go home and clean his blood out. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Yo. Elevator 666 departing for lust. Elevator 666 departing for lust. Oh, they got the, the levels of hell. I'm fucking weak. They clean up nicely. Oh, here we go. <laughs> what bullshit's about to happen? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Looney Poo. Yeah, it's Luna. Whoever you are, go for it. Hey, Looney. Just want to let you know I'm not going to be back home until real late. I got something important tonight. Go fuck this shit up. <laughs> Fucking bitch. 
<laughs> Look at the hot and ready song. Hot and ready like Krispy Kreme. <laughs> Uh, you're not on the list. You got a reservation? Oh yeah, I'm with those two. This club is for couples only. It's what? No date, no reservation. You got nipple tape? No entry. <laughs> you know, you have really nice eyes, Daddy. <laughs> so get out of here! I like that. You fucking prude! <laughs> I thought that was gonna happen. <laughs> You're angry. <laughs> he said, well, fine. What the hell is this? Cereal. Uh, Satan nut Cheerios? Oh, no. Not the owl. <laughs> oh, I see Soka. You about to go on a date? <laughs> I love novella. <laughs> they got novellas in hell. Why won't you love me, Alejandro? That's a mood, Gabriella. <laughs> Oh, he's gonna be his couple. <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> hello, hello, Blitzy. Stolas. Hey, you, uh. She busy tonight? <laughs> um, why do you ask? I was wondering if you want to come with me to a club tonight. Are you asking me on a date, Blitzy? Kawhi. Yes, I suppose that is what's happening. How fast can you get down to lust? I can be ready in 20. All right, fantastic. See you soon. I'll see you, Blitzy. Wasn't that phone just wired? <laughs> yeah, I just... <laughs> <laughs> what type of witchcraft? I'm about to see a sexy owl. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> yeah. oh, he gonna come with like a fur around his neck? I'm here. Or not. <laughs> wow. That's a bit overkill, don't you think? <laughs> Well, well, I, I just wanted to look a little nicer for you. This is our first reunion. Yo, that cape is fire. Look inside it's of moving. it. It's moving. It's fucking moving. I, I guess this is. That's huh? so lit. It's got the galaxy in it. You again. Beat it, shithead. Ahem. Do we have a problem? <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, my apologies, your house. Uh, <laughs> please, go right in. He's <laughs> like, <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh my. Oh no. No, but yes. <laughs> oh, but they got the books. <laughs> How romantic is this? What made you choose such Yo, look at the shark in the background. <laughs> oh, it just sounded like I just thought we'd have a blast here, you know? God. Hey, yo, he's getting head over the same one. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, Blitz, what are you looking at? I'm looking at nothing. How about that? Can I get you two off? I mean, Yo. start you two off with some drinks. Yes, and um, <laughs> perhaps some wine to share. Do Can I get you two off? Red wine or white blitz? Or perhaps some champagne? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> perhaps all three. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> so, blitz, how was your day? Huh? Oh, uh, good, I guess. We killed a bunch of beardos. That sounds fun. How did you kill them? How? Oh, I, I mean, oh, there was a lot of them, so I don't bullets. Right, right. So, what made you decide to ask me out after all this time? Uh, <laughs> I'm in the beginning. Would you love me if I was still a lamp? <laughs> Oh, this guy again? Sweet and sweet. Get him some love. Did you just see us notice? Oh, no fucking way. Not him. I am the <laughs> one and only Fizzerali. Some of you might recognize this dashing clown face from my numerous toy logic replicas across the <laughs> yep, ring. Yep, Lululand. Gloriously designed by Ooh. the big man himself. And, uh, ribbed for your pleasure tonight. Oh. We have a great lineup for you tonight. Ferocica Mayday, Wet Dream, and <laughs> Damn. The Squirter. The Squirter is what? <laughs> Warming up. I got a funny one for y'all. Did any of you hear 
about the fat shittery that happened at Lululand? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, wow. You know, I'll tell you what. I'd sure love to shake the hand of the crazy son of a bitch who decided to burn down that off-brand shithole and then well, slap I'm a here. subpoena in it, because I'm very much looking at a zoo. That <laughs> robo me made us more money entertaining those kids than the ones we sell to get you freaks off, if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> or, I know what you mean! I have four of them! <laughs> okay, keep that guy far away from me. <laughs> any more time our little opening act is a fresh one coming at us from a little imp from the wrath ring give it up for moxie oh with no creative stage name whatsoever <laughs> <laughs> i love you bitch <laughs> i will never you stop loving you bitch <laughs> hi and thank you for letting me be here it's an honor to play uh hurry up bullet <laughs> this song is for my beautiful wife. Heard the same, boy. First anniversary. Oh no, Ernst! I love you, Millie. And uh, ah yes, unskippable. Political added that. And we're getting a double whammy after this. Oh brother! Wow, they just gave away our location and shit. Wow, another unskippable. Love you bitch. <laughs> more than the brimstone loves the fire. More than the Elsa loves her bub. More than a maggot loves gangrenous stubs. You make my spirit sing. Yeah, you make me glad <laughs> I think about the booty stick off stage. Our love is a story sweet to tell. Yeah, <laughs> Yo. Cast a special satanic spell over my heart. Love is a journey we this is way too wholesome for hell. Right. You singing love songs in my lustful lounge. Here we go. From the groin to the bust in desire we trust in the house of us trumpet if he came here to sing your serenade perform your feelings on a velvety stage. Well, we got a saying that's popular in these parts. Only little bitches strum the strings in their heart. Turn the hang around this lustful town. Ditch the loving dummy before we knock you around. Sing about wars and desire. Depravity, savagery, loin hotter than fire. So give me a thrust. <laughs> Show me some lust. From the groin to the bust. Little imp, you just must. In the house of Osmodia. They're gonna have a musical in this damn episode. This is the only musical I'll accept. Make sure the sun. Ever. Hey, yo. <laughs> Damn. That's the girl from the um Yeah, from that one episode. Yeah, well Luna like the black guy. Yep. Yeah, that was a park is about episode. Yeah, Is your data demon prince? Stokes, is that you? Are you sleeping with an amp? My dark lord, how 
the mighty do fall. You used to have a smoking wife, a kid, you had it all. I hope you didn't give it up so you and him could get it up. Hey, yo. You sold your life for a thrust. Sold your life for a thrust. <laughs> <laughs> I think you were trying to say something for me, Max. Yeah, I was. I love us. I love us just the way we are. <laughs> we wow. The price of having tails. Be a great stripper. And if you can offer the same fate, we'll handle the rest. Cause I love you. Cause I love you. Now everybody start fucking. <laughs> you being a Sundare? You know what? This was a mistake. All right, let's just let's just leave. Oh, right. Of course. <laughs> that cape is so fire, bro. Mm. Oh, ain't that just such a happy display? It sickens me. <laughs> Get the fuck out. <laughs> Get out <of> my cape. <laughs> Did you eat you? <laughs> Damn. Thank you for inviting me out tonight. Despite everything that's happened, I, I enjoyed spending time with you. Yeah. You know, I have some more wine in the house. Octavia's with her mother this weekend, so we could. I'm not fucking you tonight, okay? I'm really just, I'm really not in the mood, Stolas. We could talk or watch a movie or maybe cuddle. Solace, don't act like what we have is anything but you wanting me to fuck you, okay? You make that really clear all the time. But I just, I, I can't do it tonight, okay? I'm sorry. Okay. Good night, Blitz. Night. <laughs> he peeled out. So, <laughs> so does Blitz actually like him and he's upset that he was just using him like... That's what that's looking it's like. It's a piece of meat or something. Like that's what it sounds like. They were once in love, but now they're in lust. <sighs> yeah. She gave it all up for a quick bus. I was thought you were gonna say thrust, but that was an opportunity that I fucked up. It's okay. <laughs> Screams. <laughs> Money? I was not expecting that. Emotions? I'm not supposed to feel those. <laughs> right, that was okay. <laughs> I didn't come here for emotions. Wow. Okay, that was dope. Anything at the end? Oh, I got like 48 seconds left, maybe. Nope. Nope. Yeah, that is it, my friend. Spindle horse. In memory of Steve Dorian. Oh man. Rest in peace to Steve. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, brother. How did you feel about that uh that episode of Hell of a Boss? Episode seven. I feel like they're about to set us up for a whole new season and I love it. No facts. That feels like a setup for the fucking we gonna find out what the fuck happened between those two. Yeah, I mean I I just assumed there was going to be more seasons just based off the fact that they made you know, like, okay, this is season one. Like, yes. S1, E1 through, you know, seven. And I think there's a, probably going to be a part two because that kind of yeah. just was open-ended. <laughs> but, no, it's going to be like season two, episode one. You're like, what? Right. Huh? Like, Nani? You said finale part one. <laughs> finale part two coming in three seasons. There you go. <laughs> nah, but I really want to really see what happened between those two because it, like, it looks like they might have had something. But then Stolas was just what? There was a bug. 
Oh. There's like the little gnat that was attacking you earlier. Oh, the gnat gnat? Yeah. Yeah. But there was um like they looked like they had something going on where they both were just consensual whatever the fuck they have going on. And then it looks like someone fell in love and someone fell in love too late. Yeah, I feel like maybe it was uh so obviously um Stolas was married, had a family and all that stuff. So I don't think they had anything prior to what they had going on. I feel like he was just like um, Blitzo. Blitzo was kind of just like a, a booty call for him. You know what I'm saying? And Blitzo was like, all right, well, I'm more than just that. So the fact that you're using me for that, you know, upsets me because he went there to a place where only couples were allowed. So he had him go there and he saw these people as couples and saw all of them like in love or in lust or whatever. And I think it got it got him in his feelings because, like, all right, well, I don't have a significant somebody else. So I think that kind of like, the closest Mess thing he has him. is a booty call. Right, exactly. So I, I think that was his uh, his whole thing about it. So, yeah. Didn't expect it to go that direction. Though. That was that was kind of heavy then. I was like, oh, shit, okay. I thought he was just going to fuck their dinner. up. Right, that's what I thought. <laughs> you know, but... <laughs> Get the fuck out! <laughs> right, I was... He said, are you singing love songs in my uh, house of lust? Or my club of lust or something like that? I was like, yeah. Oh, how adorable. I fucking hate it. Get the fuck out! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, true. It's like why? Wow. <laughs> but yeah, no, it was good though. It was good. They they always they haven't missed yet. Um, and I don't, th- really I don't think they will. And it's gonna be bold, but I, I will say that they give Disney musicals a run for their money. <laughs> their musicals are actually like the music is good, the lyrics are actually surprisingly good. They flow well. You this, know what I'm saying? Like, this is like the musical for adults. Where? No, yeah, no bullshit. It's like an adult musical. It's like an adult Disney. You know what I'm saying? But like the hell version. So, I- I usually absolutely so abhor. Disneyland. I abhor musicals. Oh yeah, musicals. but this one is just like it works. Yeah, they do of, it right. Instead of Disneyland, they got Satanland. So <laughs> I'm gonna let it snow. The snow's going to fall. Let it flow. <laughs> and this one was like, I want to fuck. I want to put it in your butt. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I'm like what? <laughs> Facts. Oh, that's my alarm. <laughs> Let me go grab that shit real quick. <laughs> Why is that shit going off right now? Who knows? Yeah. No, this shit is mad cool. I love this. This is amazing for what it is. But yeah, no, it's, I cannot it's definitely wait for good. Season. Next season cannot come fast enough. No, facts. We keep saying next season. It's, there's still a part two that hasn't come out for the finale. It's that's how much yet. I'm ready for this shit. Let's <laughs> keep it rolling. Let's keep this yet. gravy train rolling. Yeah, that's true. That's true, but... um. Because, like, this is... I thought this just want to be, like, you know, a chill YouTube show. You yeah. Know, a little, little something-something. This ain't a little something-something. No, not no more. This thing has definitely this is turned quality, into... It's quality content. Yeah, it's, it's definitely evolved into something that is... Uh, that has, you know, obviously a fan base of following and got funding for an actual show, like, with, you know, Hasbro Hotel, which is now picked up by A1. So, I mean, they... They're good, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, Vivzi has, has officially transcended just regular YouTuber. She is now at that at that status where, you know, she has a whole team and everybody's just getting projection in order and, and it's it's turned out really good. Really yeah. fucking good. This is probably something I'll say was needed because like every other cartoon you see is just generic usual fuck shit. Mm-hmm. And then you have this which is based in hell. Yeah. <laughs> so you can literally do whatever the fuck you want to do with Pretty no much. consequences. Pretty much. And, this, and, and the vulgarity is assumed at this point because, like, okay, it's hell. So, yeah. obviously, you're going to have cussing. You're going to have death. You're going to have blood and gore. Like, it's, it's just an assumed... Uh, it's, they're just assumed attributes based off of what the context is. Hold know? on to that because I was not expecting that head to roll first thing in the episode. No, that definitely took me by surprise. <laughs> I was like, yo, already? Like, all right. Like, we just that's, started. That's nice. <laughs> I literally just got here, man. But, yeah, no, that was, that was dope. I definitely enjoyed it thoroughly. Never thought I'd be able to remember some of these characters. Yeah, no, the characters, like, I, I actually remember their names. Like, Moxie, Blitzo, uh, Stolas, Stolas um, Luna. Luna. What's the other, the male imp's name? The one married to Moxie? Oh, no, this is Beast Boy to me. Beast Boy to you? I'm fucking weak. I can't remember his name. It's Beast Boy's voice actor, so. What the fuck? No, it's Billy. Hmm? It's Billy's Billy. voice actor. Sounds like Beast Boy. No, it's Billy. I might be getting confused because it's been a while since yeah. I've seen it. I think times. you're getting confused, bro, because Beast Boy did not sound like that, bro. I just remember him having like a childish kind of voice. It was childish, but it was kind of raspy, too. So, yeah. But yeah, man. That's all I got, though. It's all episode. 
I hope we get part two before the before the year's over. I really do, because I love this. Facts. All right, bro, take this out, man, unless you got something else. Nope, I got nothing else. Um, long Bad. live tall to us. Long live that fucking cape, goddammit. Yeah, that cape was, that shit was drip, bro. That was fire. <laughs> this man had a whole galaxy in the cape, bro. That like, moved. It, it fucking yeah, moved. Yeah, that shit was fire, bro. I was like, okay, I fuck with that heavy. And I don't know what kind of budget y'all put on that cape. Yes. <laughs> Say, hey, we got uh, some extra budget. What do you want to do? The uh, cape. Give it to Stoas' cape. <laughs> Stoas' Sto- cape versus Cosmo's hand. Oh, my God. The budgets. <laughs> All right, y'all know what to do. Come up, like, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. You yeah. um, Thank you to Vizzy Pop for making such an amazing fucking series. Absolutely. Fire. That love through and fucking through. Just pure awesomeness. Indeed. And debauchery, my favorite. Oh my, my personal God. favorite. <laughs> we got the Spookage. Bonnie Kruger. Happy Halloween, y'all. The Animated, out. Peace.